All right. I want to welcome everybody here to the initial broadcast. We're at the Horde Athletic Complex out here, about a half mile west of the Andrew College campus on Highway 82. We got a bit of a doubleheader today. Both uh, softball and baseball are opening their seasons, and we're going to do the first game of the softball uh, doubleheader. They are playing the Grange College JV. After that game, we'll shut it all down, move it over to the baseball side, and do the uh, do the baseball second game of their doubleheader. Uh, they are playing Thomas University JV. Again, season opener for both teams. These games were originally scheduled for um, tomorrow, but with uh, weather coming in, uh, it made it a little bit difficult to... Uh, they weren't sure about what was predicting the weather, so they want to go ahead and make sure they got it in. They don't play again until Monday. Baseball plays Monday and then softball on Tuesday and Wednesday, so they wanted to make sure we got this one in. So both teams, uh, visiting teams, agreed to move it on up. So we weren't planning on doing this game, but since it got moved up a day, and me and my crew of uh, Maddie, Maddie Thompson and Bailey Rutherford, Selene Eli, Lisa Richards, came out of yesterday, and uh, Ashley West was here, and uh, did a trial run on the thing and got it up and running, and it looks pretty good. And got a new format here with BoxCast, and we also have HD out here, so... Hopefully you'll enjoy that. Uh, we don't have the one thing we don't have with um, uh, BoxCast. We don't right now. We don't have a way to talk back and forth to each other. But I do have an email address, and it is uh, Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. If you want to give me a shout out and let me know you're tuned in, uh, if the sound's not sounding right, too loud. Uh, Sorry, Bosch came by and asked me about it. Anyway, uh, if you'll just shoot me an email, let me know the sound is good. Sherry Brown is usually a watcher. Sherry, uh, shoot me an email, markbrown at andrewcollege.edu. Let me know it sounds good. Picture looks good. And, again, we got about 15 minutes to game time. We have a couple ceremonial things to do. The baseball team, although we won't have it on camera, will be an Manda. Our athletic trainer will be throwing out a first pitch, and then... Maddie Thompson, our women's soccer player, is going to give us a stirring rendition of the national anthem. She was out here yesterday practicing, and it was inspiring. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to get a good, good uh, listen on that. I'll try and hold up the microphone so that you can. That's going to be in about 10 minutes or so. So we're going to try and get the starting lineups over with here prior to uh, all that getting started. Uh, for LaGrange, they are the Panthers, I believe, the Lady Panthers. They are going to... Hold on one sec. No, I need her here ASAP. All right, for the Lady Panthers from LaGrange College, leading off will be number two, second baseman, Kaylee Faircloth. Batting second and playing third, number 10, Sutton Bridges. Batting third and playing left, number 88, Brittany Todd. Batting fourth and doing the pitching, number 29, Jessica Perkins. Batting fifth and DP, number 13, Madison Martin. Mm, batting sixth and playing first base, number 25, Caitlin Redman. Batting sixth and doing the catching, number 23, Shelby Olney. Batting 7th and playing short, number 40, Katie Thomas. Batting 8th and playing center, number 30, Addie Scott. And batting ninth and playing right field, number 98, Monica Murphy.
All right, giving out some instruction. And Nessu is going to be uh, throwing out the first pitch for the baseball game. And I need Celine to record that for prosperity. And she's on her way over there. For the Lady Fighting Tigers, leading off and playing center, number seven, Kenley Kennedy. Batting second and playing shortstop, number six, Taylor Sheffield. Batting third and playing second base, number 23, Kaylin Pruitt. Batting fourth and playing third, number 34, Angela Heimbeck. And batting fifth, the first baseman, number eight, Hope Dalton. Batting sixth and doing the catching, number 20, Devin Weaver. Batting seventh and in the circle, number 25, Charlie Smith. Batting eighth and playing right field, number four, Macy Ibister. And batting ninth and playing left field, number 16, Ashton Bray. Both teams just about done with their warm-ups. And we'll be back in just a minute. Again, if anybody out there, I got six viewers, and I'm sure we'll pick up more. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. Let me know you're tuned in. We'll give you a shout-out. Let me know if the sound sounds okay. Again, this is our first broadcast from out here. We've been doing basketball for since the season started, and uh, it's been uh, going pretty well. And uh, so hopefully everything sounds good, looks good. Aaron, I don't know if you're tuned in, and uh, you might be at golf practice right now, but... Anyway, let me know. All right, we'll be back.
Hi right, again, Mark Brown back here on the Andrew College Digital Network, ACDN as we call it around here. Uh, getting ready for today's matchup between the Lady Panthers of LaGrange and the Andrew College Fighting Tigers. All right, Bailey. I'm joined by Bailey Rutherford, my usual crew, Selene Eli. Uh, Lisa Richards will be here shortly. I got a new work study personnel. What is your last name, Chanel? Tasher. 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 Chanel Tasher. Uh, Ashley West, usual, will join our crew, but she had to go home this weekend, so we picked up one, and, and Ashley will be back. Again, we'll be on the air for this game on... Uh, uh, Oh, Neander College Digital Network. Uh, I wish we could get this here, but um, an FC Banda throwing out the first pitch over there for getting a big hand from the girls over here. Everybody tuned in, and that's who got it in there. <laughs> so good effort by Nessu Banda. And off we go. What you need? All right. So Anessa was throwing out the first pitch. I don't see Celine over there, but she's supposed to have recorded that for posterity. Andrew Serves is out here. They got the concession stand up and running. I see Lexi, Miss Bray. I don't know who else is out there, but uh, a lot of excitement. First day, obviously. And again, we're up to seven viewers. And again, uh, we don't have the old chat back and forth, but we do have the. Uh, you can e email me. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. I will be able to uh, uh, read your email and give you a shout out and let me know how the sound is. And let's going to get started here with uh, the lineups and everything else. Here come the visiting team. Kaylee Faircloth. Sutton Bridges. Brittany Todd. Jessica Perkins. Madison Martin. Caitlin Redmond. Shelby Olney. Katie Thomas. Hattie Scott. Monica Murphy. And here come the rest of the LaCrange. Here come the starting line for Andrew College. Heading off of the Tigers and playing center, Kenley Kennedy. Number six, playing shortstop, Taylor Sheffield. Second base for number 23, Kalen Pruitt. Third baseman, number 34, Angela Heimbach. First baseman, number eight, Hope Dalton. Behind the plate, number 20, Devin Weaver. In the circle, number 25, Charlie Smith. Right fielder, number four, Macy Ibister. And left fielder, number 16, Ashton Bray. 
Head coach Kayla Williams, Laura Darden, I forgot to mention uh, Jessica McCormick. And now here comes Maddie, Maddie Thompson. What an outstanding job there. Maddie Thompson. What a great rendition. Sent chills down your spine. So opening day. Always an exciting time. No matter what it is. New hope. New dreams. New season. Starting fresh. Again, Maddie did a fantastic job right there. She just came by here. She is one of my work study crew. I can't act to take no credit for that, but uh, she's a, doing a fine job right here. Again, if you want a shout out, let us know you're watching. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. Send me an email. Mark Brown at andrewcollege.edu. We will, uh, we will uh, try and keep you up. Open up the chrome real quick, uh, Maddie. See, I mean, uh, Bailey. One more time. <laughs> All right. Looks like both teams are ready. Celine will be taking pictures. Bailey will be running the computer. The 2018 season just about underway. Charlie with your first pitch. First pitch right in there for strike one. No, a little bit high. 304 on the uh, on the uh, starting time. 1-0 pitch stays high. Again, we're on our new box cast here. Hope everybody enjoys the HD. Change our camera a little bit. 2-0 from Charlie. Just outside. Okay, um... Kaylee Faircloth, second base leading off. Beautiful day out here. Again, the game's moved up a day. 3 0 pitch. Called strike one. I think Kaylee thought too much of that, but. She'll settle back in. Three balls, one strike. Nobody out. Just about hit her. So Faircloth draws a walk. Got to bring up third baseman, number 10, Sutton Bridges. Yeah. Okay. See if uh, LaGrange is going to put it down. Try and keep up with baseball as best we can. Again, they're playing Thomas, Can uh, Thomas University JV. No bunt, ground ball to Sheppy. Took a wicked bad hop. 
Guess that ought to go as a hit. That was a bad hop. So Bridges with a single. And the Panthers have runners at first and second. And nobody out. Had to bring up the left fielder, number 88, Brittany Todd. There's pitch to Brittany just outside a little bit. Eric Law threw a walk. Bridges had a bad hop single. Todd at the plate. Right in there for strike one. Foul ball from baseball ended up coming right through to right field. And Kenley out there in center had to pick it up. Send it back in. Or send it back over. The 1-1 one, one pitch. Fouled on us the first baseline. Hope giving chase, but it'll fall harmlessly foul. One ball, two strikes. Ah, the one-two pitch struck her out. Foul tips, Devin, uh, Devin Weaver able to haul that in. Defensively, the Tigers left to right. Bray, Kennedy, Ivester, third to first. Heimbeck, Sheppy, Pruitt, Dalton. Again, behind the plate, Weaver. And again, in the circle, Charlie Smith. How to bring up the pitcher, 29, Jessica Perkins. First pitch to her a little bit high. Base, uh, baseball softball, a little tougher on the computer operator. Score, not as bad. Basketball is pretty much all score. The 1-0. All strike one. Runs don't happen all that often, but the uh, changing of the uh, ball strikes and outs, got to keep heads up. The 1-1 one, one from Charlie. The roller goes to second. Kale unable to hang on to it. She's got a pretty good little spike there. Held on, so a nice play there by Kalen. Fielder's choice for Perkins. Six to four on the put out. And I think Jessica wants to get a clarification on that. She's wanted to question the uh, umpire to make sure. Coach Williams, Kayla out there to uh, check on Kalen. So now they're two outs. Two outs. Had to bring up the DP, number 13, Madison Martin. First pitch to Martin stays inside. Nice play there by Kale and just hang tough in there. Ball took a little bit to get to Sheppy, and the runner was right on top of her, but. Executed well. 1 0 pitch stays outside. Again, if you want to give me a shout out, and we don't have that anymore, but you can email me, Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. 2 0 pitch stays inside to Martin. Three balls and no strikes. Again, two outs, runners at the corners. Fair cloth at. Uh, third and Perkins at first right in there for strike one and three one popped up back this way <laughs> three two we got some soccer players out here and they were in panic mode when that thing came down <laughs> Three balls, two strikes, two outs. That means Perkins will be off and running. Devin having to get some maintenance on her helmet. They're going to have to bring out the backup helmet while they work on this one. Coach Laura will take a look at it, see if she can't get it repaired. 
Oh, Madison Martin, three balls, two strikes, two outs. Again, Parkins at first will be roffing on the pitch. Lift it to left, pretty deep. Back goes Bray, back goes Bray. About 10 feet shy of the wall, pulls it in. So Charlie gives up a walk and a single and works out of it. For no runs. And we'll go to the bottom half of the second here. On the or bottom half of the first, Tigers will come to bat. Where's he moving? That's even worse. I know. <laughs> Is she the one moving it? No. I mean, you might as well go ahead and draw a big bullseye on it if you're going to park it right there. Alright, picks will get started on the boys' side. Looks like Thomas had a scoreless first. Leading off again for the Tigers will be the center fielder, number seven, Kenley Kennedy. In the circle for the Panthers, Jessica Perkins. Defensively for the Panthers, left to right, Todd Scott Murphy. Third to first, Bridges, Thomas, Faircloth, Redmond. Behind the plate is Olney. And again, Perkins in the circle. Kenley's first pitch driven to center. That's deep. Off the wall. Kenley on her way to second. She'll pull him with a stand-up double. Brand new wall. Just got painted yesterday. I think it got finished up this morning. The backside did. So Kenley uh, decided to bang one off of it right off the bat. Scott able to get it back in. That'll bring up our shortstop, number six, Taylor Sheffield. Everybody calls her Sheffy. She probably wouldn't know what her, who to call. Started calling about her full name. Bottom half of the first. Kenley with a double to lead it off. First pitch to Sheffy. Squares the bunt. Pulls back. Falls on the ground. Kennedy in between. Nobody forcing her back, so. Stayed out. Long as she could. One ball, no strikes, no outs. One ball is high. It's not on YouTube anymore. Mm -mm. All bobble by the catcher. Kenley takes advantage, moves the third. All right, so Kenley now at third. Two balls and a strike. Good cut by Sheffy right there. Foul straight back. Two-two pitch from Perkins. 
Ground ball to third, just foul though. Sheffield get to do it again. All right. Y'all done with practice already? Acacia and Z, Z Y, is that what everybody calls you? Zai. So Zai is uh, not one of my work study people too. So they are now out to join us. They're done with basketball practice. Two two pitch again to Sheffy, hammered but foul. Down the third base line, and Mr. Hamby is here. My uh, work study crew is unbelievably good. Okay, I'm going to set all this stuff up, take care of all the stuff that's got to be taken care of. And here we go again. 2-2 two -two pitch. Line foul again. Kenley over there having to... <laughs> The duck tied, having to go down in the corner and retrieve again. Tensions are to do the uh, softball game first, and then do the second, do the second game of the baseball game, baseball doubleheader. Two-two pitch, high on the infield. Redmond giving hauls it in for the first out. So Sheffield unable to get the run in. Had to bring up second baseman, number 23, Kaylin Pruitt. Pruitt made that nice play at second. Forced a runner out second for the second out of the inning. Runner bearing down on her. First pitch from Perkins stays low. I believe Kalen is a, both a slapper and a stand there hitter, and she'll work with both of them. Tigers, uh, the baseball team up 1 nothing. Not sure what happened over there, but Tigers on top 1 0. Ball kicks away. Here comes Kenley. And Tigers score their first run of the year. Two-oh pitch. Stays outside. She does it hard too. Trail stays low. Caitlin draws a walk. What's that? All right, so Jennifer, I have to talk with Perkins and She's done. That'll bring up third base and 34, Angela Heimack. Heimack had a great year last year. Kaylin driven up the middle. Knocked down by Faircloth. And everybody's safe. So Kaylin hustling up. We're going to give Angela a single on that. Let's go, Hope. That'll bring up the third base when Hope, David, uh, Hope yeah. Dalton. <laughs> With one out. First pitch to Hope. Just thought about Bunton, pulled back. Took it for ball one. So Pruitt at second. She drew a walk. I'm back at first. She singled. The 1 0 -oh pitch to Hope. Does get it down. Beautiful Bunt. Only play Redmond to Faircloth. So a good sacrifice bunt there by Hope. One to four. With two outs, that'll bring up a catcher, Devin Weaver. Hunter's now at second and third. Oh, compared to the other ones. <laughs> yeah, they 
First pitch. Dabbing is high. What's the baseball score? Is it still one nothing or is it two? What is it? One nothing? Okay, baseball still one nothing bottom of the first. Foul back. The one one pitch. Hung on and missed. The one two pitch. Bounces up there. Nice play by Olney. And Kalen Pruitt at third. Angela Heim back at second. Kennedy double to lead off the inning. Scored on a wild pitch. 2-2 two, two stays low. Full count. You do know what... That's what I was like, I'm so bad at it. It's okay, 3-2 pitch. Hammer right at the shortstop, Thomas. Devin hit that ball in the nose. Right at Thomas, so... Tigers pick up one. We go to the top half of the second here on the ACDN. Baseball up now, I think, 2-0. 4-0. Uh, no, 2-0. 3-0. Okay. They got three runs, four hits. Still in the bottom of the first over there. And yeah, we're in the top of the second. And we'll be back. Top of the second. First baseman, Caitlin Redman. Redman to lead off. First fish from Charlie popped up into shallow center. Kennedy under it. She'll haul it in for the first out. Again, defensively doesn't appear anything's changed. Bray, Kennedy, and Iverster in the uh, outfield. Iverster. Heimbeck, Sheppy, Pruitt, Dalton on the infield. Weaver behind the plate, and again, Charlie in the circle. Another foul ball from baseball ends up in right field. Macy has to go chase it. Catcher Shelby Olney at the plate. Just outside. Pitch gets the outside corner for strike one. Again, opening day here on the Andrew College Digital Network out here at the Horde Athletic Complex. 1-1 one, one pitch stays outside. Uh, yeah. Two-one pitch popped into shallow right at Macy. Hauls it in for the second out of the inning. Again, Bailey Rutherford running the computer, doing a good job. That'll bring up the shortstop, number 40, Katie Thomas. Two outs, nobody on here. Hit hard down the third base line, just foul.
kind of a hard. Oh, one pitch is low. Scoreboard says one ball, no strikes, but there is definitely one strike. Foul ball. Change up. Thomas way out ahead. And one ball, two strikes. Almost hit her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're missing a they're missing the scoreboard says two one, but it is two two. Mm-hmm. Two two pitch. How back. Oh. Got a big crowd on both sides over here. Baseball and softball foul balls are a menace to society. Tigers looks like over there they picked up five in the first. Little looper in the left, Ashton. Have to play on one hop. Well, oh, two out single there by Thomas. I'm going to bring up the center fielder, number 30, Addie Scott. Addie Scott, first pitch from Charlie. Must have been low. Nope, call strike one. Oh, one little ground ball. Hope able to pick it up. Nobody going to get there, though. Hope probably ventured a little too far off there. Guess I'll have to go to a single. Bring us back to the top of the lineup. Second baseman Kaylee Faircloth. Kaylee drew a walk to open up the game. First pitch is outside. We're going to have a courtesy runner here. I mean, a pinch runner. Number 31, Elizabeth Smith, that appears. And it is. Georgia. Yeah, I would say North Georgia, but mm. I guess like North. Somebody hurt. <laughs> Nessu uh, Banda again threw out the first pitch in the baseball game, but he's having to do double duty here with uh, both of them. Uh, he's in the LaGrange dugout right now checking on the LaGrange player. So two outs, one ball, no strike, and Kaylee Faircloth at the plate. The 1-0. Just outside. Again, Faircloth to a walk her first time up. Little looper in the center. That's going to get down. Kenley up quickly. Throw to the plates. Cut off. They get the runner going to third. The run will count. So Perko off on an RBI single. And looks to appear that, uh, let's see, who would that have been? Probably Katie Thomas was thrown out at third. Throw home was cut off by Charlie. He's through to third. Angela able to apply the tag. Well, the grain is on the board, and we're all tied up here. We go to the bottom of the second, 1-1, one, one, here on the Andrew College Digital Network.
All right. Jessica Perkins. Back in the circle, Charlie Smith at the plate. I believe Smith is going to right. <laughs> Bottom of the second, one apiece. Ball foul down the third, first base line. Again, if you want to give a shout out, let us know. Tell me how it sounds. Mark Brown here doing the announcing with my ACDN crew. No talking on these things here where we used to be able to talk on YouTube, but you can email me, Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. All hit hard right at Thomas. Over to Redmond. What a first out. Macy Ives tried to play. Sorry about that. First pitch inside to Macy. One old pitch right in there for strike one. pitch. Hit her. So we have Macy on the hard way. I'm going to bring up left fielder. Number 16, Ashton Bray. After Bray, we'll be back to the top of the lineup with Kenley. First shit to Ashton is high and outside. The one old Ashton. Popper down the right field. Bridges going back. Bridges with a nice over the shoulder or turn around catch there. But with Iverster at first and two outs, back to the top of the lineup for Kenley Kennedy. Kennedy let off the game with a double to center. Hybister with good wheels at first. First pitch to Kenley. Good hack. Foul back. Come on, KJ! Still 5 0. 5 0 over there. Bottom of the second now in the baseball game. Didn't mean to. Little ground ball to Faircloth over to Redmond for the third out of the inning. So Perkins works around a hit batter and we go to the top of the third here. Still tied at one apiece here on the Andrew College Digital Network.
high top half of the third. Sutton Bridges at the plate. Bridges singled her first time up on a bad hop single. Two balls and no strikes. Scoreboard says uh, second inning, but it is a third. Big swing and a miss. Caitlin. Caitlin. Third inning. Charlie's still in the circle. Two one pitch. Just outside. <laughs> Tigers got another run. Baseball, that is. 3-1 pitch. Hit hard, but right at Kalen. Over to Hope. 4-4-3 four four, put out in the first out of the inning. Got to bring up left fielder, number 88, Brittany Todd. Brittany strikeout victim her first time up. Swing and a miss there from Todd. Charlie out ahead quickly. Another swing and a miss. Charlie out quickly, uh, out ahead. O2, tied another strikeout. Two outs. Another ring of the pitcher, Jessica Perkins. Perkins reached on a fielder's choice her first time up. Two outs, nobody on here. Top half of the third. Nice pitch on the outside corner there from Charlie. One is outside. <laughs> All right, I want to give a shout out to Tanya Harris who gave us an audio check there. Appreciate that. One one just outside. Appreciate that, Tanya. Like I said, we're not able to be able to talk back and forth like we used to on YouTube, but uh, again, you can shoot me an email, Mark Brown at AndrewCollege.edu. Well, let me know. 2-1. Popped up straight up in the middle of the diamond. Devin. An awkward play for a catcher. Put a third out of the inning. Well, three up, three down for Charlie. And we'll go to the bottom half of the third. Still tied at one apiece.
Sheppy to lead it off for the Tigers. Sheppy popped up to first, her first time up. Looks like uh, Perkins is still in the circle. 1 0 pitch right in there for strike one. As far as I can tell, defensively, it looks like Todd Scott Smith in the outfield. The 1 1 stays high. Bridges Thomas Faircloth Redman. Third to first, only behind the plate. And again, Jessica Perkins in the circle. Again, this is game one of the doubleheader here today. After this one, we're going to pack up, move across the uh, complex here. A, a one two pitch, or a two one pitch in there for strike two. Move about 60 feet over there and uh, maybe 90 and set up underneath and do the second game of the baseball doubleheader. Round ball to short. Thomas. Gotcha. What a strong throw to Redmond. For the first out of the inning. And bring up second baseman, Kalen Pruitt. Pruitt to a walker, first time up. And just a reminder to everybody, we're going to pack up everything after the baseball game, take it back up to the college campus, and we'll be doing the basketball game tomorrow. First pitch to Kalen in there for strike one. Women's basketball takes on Albany Tech at 1 p.m. in Jinx. And then next week, we got another busy schedule. We're back out here for baseball on Monday, softball on Tuesday. 0-1 pitch stays low. Baseball Monday, softball Tuesday, and then a basketball doubleheader Wednesday night from Jinx. So next three or four days, kind of busy for the ACDN. And I think most teams hit the road for a week or ten. A little looped in the left, so a nice little base hit in the left. Pruitt. For their first college hit. She's still hitting a thousand. She drew a walk her first time up. That'll bring up Angela Heimbeck. Heimbeck singled her first time up. And Kenley, uh, Kennedy led the game off with a double. Went to third on a wild pitch and then scored on a wild pitch. First pitch to Angela all the way to the backstop. So Kalen able to go to second. So one out. Pruitt now at second. Jessica wants to talk. What's the baseball? Eight nothing? What inning is it? Top of the third, Tigers already up eight and zero. Bottom half the third here. One ball, no strikes on Angela. Kalen at second. Single. Went to second on a wild pitch. 1-0 stays outside. I believe hit eight home runs last year. Should have pulled up last year's stats and brought them out here with me, but I forgot to do it. So hopefully by Tuesday of next week, I'll have them for you. Angela draws a four-pitch walk. That'll put runners at now at first and second. I'll bring up first base and Hope Dalton. Hope sacrifice bunted her first time up. First baseman to second baseman. First pitch is low. Well, that was a baseball that come careening through here. One out. 1-0 pitch. 
Oh, back hands! Whoa! <laughs> well, you got a tent over the top of you, Bailey. You okay? I know. <laughs> so you got a crowd for both games out here, and foul balls going left and right, and you your heads up every now and then. <laughs> the one-one pitch caught the inside corner for strike two. Where are you going? Oh. You got to keep up with this down here now. The one two, ground ball to third. Bridges steps on, well, she doesn't step on the back. She dives and tags it. So, hope and a fielder's choice. Third baseman unassisted. And got to bring up the catcher, Devin Weaver, with two outs. Uh, Devin lined out to the shortstopper last time up. He just hit a bullet. First pitch from Perkins. In there for strike one. Yo, one swung on and missed. Devin shaking her head at herself, I think. Oh, two lifted into left. That's down. Kayla's gonna send her. Here comes Angela. Throw is off the line. Hope will roll into third. And Devin will go into second. So an RBI single for Devin Weaver. Puts the Tigers back on top now. Two one. That'll send up the pitcher Charlie Smith. Let's go, Charlie. Hope at third. Devin at second. Charlie grounded out to shorter first time up. First pitch, Charlie is high. Yeah, like One old pitch stays inside. Dale Chambles behind the plate. Dale's been coming over here to cover for 25 years. Umpired for me and both, but I coached baseball way back in the 90s and then softball in the late 2000s and still coming. Two old pitches, ace high. Three old pitch, see if Charlie's swinging here. Hits, hits. Taking all the way. <laughs> I don't know, but <laughs> right in there for strike one. Bit of big heard of big heads, and everybody ducked for cover. Three one, foul back this way. <laughs> yeah, hit the top of the concession stand. So after falling behind three zero, Perkins has battled back to full. Three two pitch rolled over the top and goes foul. Macy Ivester on deck. And season open for both teams, baseball and softball. Hamby is taking over the uh, computer. Up, oh, might take Bailey's back. Another. Whoa. <laughs> I need to start <laughs> hit you some hard hats out here <laughs> or bring your own 3-2 pitch roll over the top bridges quickly in nice scoop over there by Redman so uh, Perkins works out of a jam Bridges with a nice play, and Redmond with a nice pick over there at first. Well, we go to the top of the fourth. Here on the ACDN, we'll be back.
All right. Addison Martin at the plate, and first pitch from Charlie hits her. Tasha and them are going over to watch the baseball. Z-Y. Zy. I'm not sure if Jennifer's going to pull Martin. It looks like he is, she is. It looks like 90. Is that 99? That might be. Can you tell the number out there? That is 99, but that's. Oh, that's Monica Murphy. Okay. Yeah, Murphy is. Uh, Murphy now back in for. Okay. Anyway, that'll bring up Caitlin Redmond. First pitch. Go to second. And they got her. That's another. Kaylin with another <laughs> nice play over there. So Devin with a strike to second for the first out of the inning. No balls, two strikes on Caitlin Redmond. Redmond flew out to left her first time up. 0 2, struck her out. Third strikeout for Charlie. That'll bring up the catcher, Shelby Olney. Only flew out to right her first time up. Two outs and nobody on. Top half of the fourth here on the Andrew College Digital Network. Bailey Rutherford with me. Squares the bunt, pops straight back. Devin tried to reach up with the right hand and snag it, but probably better she didn't. The 0 1 pitch to Olney. Little looper in the right. Macy coming in, coming in. Down into the left. Kalen able to hustle out there and pull it in. Throw into second. So it'll be a double for Olney. Nice effort out there by Macy. And Kalen come out of nowhere from second base. And went in and retrieved it. So that should bring up the shortstop, Katie Thomas. Thomas singled her first time up. And only now at second with two outs. Pop straight up. Devin calls it in. Nice play there. Not an easy play. So pop up to the catcher, and that'll strand only at second. We go to the bottom of the fourth here on the Andrew College Digital Network. 2 1 Tigers.
Hi, right, bottom half of the fourth here. Out at the Horde Athletic Complex. Macy Iverster to lead it off for the Tigers. Jessica Perkins still in the circle. i not sure if Smith or Murphy is back and right, but uh, Macy again reached out hit by pitch. Hit batter. First pitch from Perkins in there for strike one. Well, looks like it's still 8 nothing. What inning are they in, Hammy? Can you tell? Bottom of the fourth over there also. Macy swings at a high fastball. Fouls it off at the plate. Ashton Howell played a couple of years ago, fouled away. Oh, she was here last year, that's right, Ashton was, because she dated. <laughs> Yo, two, stays high. One, two, and that stays outside. Two balls, two strikes. Again, nobody out, nobody on here. Ground ball to short. Thomas, way high. Macy on her way to first. I mean, Macy on her way to second. She's already at first. That'll be an E6. That'll bring up Ashton Bray. Bray popped out to the third baseman her first time up. Oh, Macy now at second with nobody out. First pitch to Ashton in there first uh first pitch in there for strike one. I love little moves. <laughs> oh, one pop back this way, gonna make So no balls, two strikes, nobody out. Macy at second, she reached on an error. And Ashton hit by pitch. I think it got her leg. Go back to the top, top of the lineup, Kenley Kennedy. Kennedy is doubled. And grounded out to second. See if Kale is bunting here, try to advance the runners, but here comes Jennifer. Maybe making a pitching change here. Megan Carlson. <laughs> Popular. All right, everybody's set. Looks like no change. Again, yeah, we'll have to keep an eye out for Kenley, see if she's bunning. Not bunning, a little popper right in the middle of the infield. Perkins able to haul it in. Well, that'll bring in Sheppy. If he's popped out to first, grounded out to short. Squared up. 
squares. Pulls back on the way to third is Macy. Throw down a third, not in time. Heads up there for Ashton. She advanced also. So now runners at second and third. One out. 1-0 one count to Sheppy. One old pitch in there for strike one. And um, she really liked it, so her fans were doing it for her birthday. Because her birthday's on the 10th, and they play up in Carrollton, I think, or something like that. The 1-1 one, one pitch right in there for strike two. Yeah, like the 9th and 10th they play. The 1-2. Let me see your third. Low. Nice play there by Olney to keep that in front. Two balls, two strikes, one out. Macy at third. Ashton at second. Good 2-2. Two, two. Hammered in the left. That's down. Here comes Macy. Ashton had to hold up. Make sure it wasn't caught. Sheppy got to be careful. Right fielder has moved in behind her. So an RBI single from Sheppy, her first hit of the season. And it drives in a run. Takes a Tiger Lee to three to one. Wow, well, baseball came out of nowhere and nobody said anything. Didn't That'll bring up second base and Kalen Pruitt. Pruitt one for one. She's walked and singled. Hits for the runners on the corners. First pitch is just low. Ashton at the third. Throw goes out past the pitcher and heads up by Ashton and she'll go to, she'll score. Sheffy on her way to third. So disastrous play there for LaGrange. A runner scored and, and uh, Sheffy with heads up ended up on third. So. All right, one ball, no strikes, one out. Sheppy on third, Pruitt at the plate. Grange pulled in a little bit. Lifted, uh, fouled on the third baseline. Well, it was right over the third base dugout, actually. Two walls, one strike, one out. Two one from Jenkins, way inside. Again, Pruitt one for one, singled and walked. Made two nice play defensive plays out at second. One on a force, one on a put out on a uh, tag out of a sly of Steeler. Three one to Pruitt. Stays low and Kalen has her second walk. That'll bring up third baseman, Angela Heinbeck. And Heinbeck also one for one. She singled in the first through a walk back in the third, which was last inning. And it was runners at the corners. Pruitt on a running, but out off the plate. And she'll have to retreat. Let's go, Ange! Hammered to left. That's down. Tied up with it. Kalen out to hold up at second. So an RBI single or second hit for Heimbeck. All 
Might have bring up Hope. Hope is sacrificed, bunted. Reach down the field. Should have loop a looper into right. If it's fair, it's trouble. Yeah, and it is. Here comes Kaylin. Man, they got her. A single for Hope. Third hit of the inning. They do pick up one. But Kaylin is thrown out at the plate. A nice throw from Todd. And that'll bring up Devin Weaver. Weaver lined out to short in the first and then an RBI single in the third. I'm back now at third and hope it's second. High in the air. Bridges giving chase. Since you haul it in for the third out. The Tigers do some damage here. Puts in the eighth to the plate. Pick up three. We go to the top of the fifth. Here on the ACDN, and we'll be back. Elizabeth Smith. First pitch in there for strike one. Oh, one pitch in there for strike two. It's like defensively the Tigers are the same. Left to right, Bray Kennedy, Ivester. Go two. Just outside. Third to first, Angela Sheppy Pruitt Dalton behind the plate, Weaver, and again, Charlie still in the circle. One ball, two strikes, nobody out. Finer. <laughs> Kalen had a glove on it, couldn't pull it in. So Smith with a single. Almost hit hard there by Smith. Kayla wasn't able to get a glove on him, but she was stretching out for it and couldn't control it. That'll bring up the leadoff hitter, Kaylee Faircloth. Faircloth was walking, had an RBI single. First pitch on the outside corner for strike one. The 0 1. Just outside. So Smith at first with a single. Top half of the fifth. One is down. Angela quickly on it over to Hope. Angela's fantastic on those plays. She can pounce on them quickly. So sack bunt. Five to three. Advance to Smith to second. Now there's one out, and that'll bring up Sutton Bridges. Bridges is singled and grounded out to second. And Angela's last year and this year, she is really good at those uh, pouncing on them little bunts just outside. 
to Bridges. Yeah, let's see, we're up to 16 viewers. Again, we don't have the old chat like we used to, but you can email me, markbrown at andrewcollege.edu. Give me a shout out, let me know you're listening. Let us know what you think of the broadcast. One old pitch stays low. Pitch is low. <laughs> well, three balls and no strikes. One out. Smith at second. She's single. Was sacrificed over by Faircloth. Squared the bunt, but it's taken all the way. Got to gather my crew up here and get ready to move. Little looper in the shallow right. Macy coming in. She has a bead on it. She'll haul it in for the second out. And that'll bring up the left fielder, Brittany Todd. Todd struck out both times she's been up to the plate. Still looks like it's 8 nothing over there on the uh, baseball side. Ground ball in the hole. That's in there. They're going to send the runner. No, they're going to hold her up. And that was an outstanding throw out there by Bastion Bray. That was a rope. So Todd with a base hit. She'll go to second on the throw home. That'll bring out the pitcher, Jessica Perkins, with two outs. And Smith at third. Todd at second. Perkins. First pitch on the outside corner for strike one. Perkins reached on a fielder's choice and popped out to the catcher. And there are two at bats. Field one. Just a little low. All off at the plate. One ball, one strike. The one two pitch just missed. Tigers were heading off the field. They thought that was in there for strike three, but not to be the 2-2. Two -two. That one was. Perkins caught looking. One, two, three, four strikeout for Charlie. And we'll go to the bottom half of the fifth here on the ACDN. We'll be back.
All right, new pitcher for the Panthers is Elmsley Smith, left-hander. Looks like a new catcher also back here. I believe that is... I believe it's Madison Martin, I believe. Kind of hard to keep up with the visitors, and then we don't get notified by the umpires, so sometimes it's just a, a guess. But <coughs> <coughs> and that is the pitcher is Elmsley Smith, and I think the catcher is Martin. Either way, the batter is Charlie Smith. Charlie's grounded out to third and grounded out to short, and her two at bats. 5-1 Tigers here, top of the uh, bottom of the fifth. Brown ball, hair cloth to Redmond. <laughs> one pitch, one out. That'll set up Mace. Mace has been hit by a pitch and reached on an air. Helmsley Smith in the circle now. Change up. It's a state inside. One old pitch right in there, strike one. One ball, one strike. Round ball to short. Thomas fumbles it. Strong throw, and they don't get her. I believe that was Thomas. So Macy reaches on an air. That'll send up Ashton Bray. Bray has popped out to third and been hit by a pitch. First pitch from Smith is low. Again, first game of the season here. We're going to be broadcasting this game. And then gather up everything, move it over to the baseball field, and do the second game of the baseball doubleheader. Just outside. Two balls, no strikes. One out. Over. Well, the baseball game is over. Looks like the Tigers have won ten nothing. Gonna be hard pressed to get over there and get that game. Two one pitch to Bri uh, Ashton. Out off. Two balls and two strikes. Again, the baseball team has won ten nothing over against Thomas J uh, Thomas University JB. Softball here leading five one. Bottom of the fifth. Throw goes to first. Macy back. It's close. Three two count. See if Macy's going. Wouldn't be surprised. Line but foul. So we'll do it again. Miss a 3 2 pitch. Swung on and missed. Another throw to first. 
Nice change up there from Elmsley Smith. Back to the top of the lineup, Kenley Kennedy. Kenley one for three, doubled. Grounded out, popped out. Macy at first with two outs now. Ground ball to third, Bridges to Redmond. Redmond, I'm able to handle the throw. That'll be an E3. Now to bring up Sheppy. Sheppy one for three also. Popped out, grounded out, and had an RBI single last inning. First pitch is low. Pitch in there for strike one. Maybe that was the first pitch. I thought the first pitch was low. Right in there for strike two. Come on, Chef! One ball, two strikes, two outs. Hammered the foul. Baseball game is over with. We're going to be hard pressed to get the uh, beginning of that up before this one ends and us get us all this equipment moved over. All right, we'll do the 0 2 again. Ground ball into the hole. Be a base hit for Sheppy. Oh, made it past the third baseman. The shortstop Thomas picked it up. Bridges tried to scramble back, but not in time. So an infield single for Sheppy. That's her second hit of the day. And that'll bring up second baseman Kalen Pruitt. Pruitt is one for one. Single in the third and a pair of walks. Bases loaded. First pitch swung on and missed. Two outs. Fouled off. No balls, two strikes, two outs, bases loaded. Go two, stays inside. Notice the new wall out here, just got painted yesterday. Nice pretty navy blue wall, and they also got the safety nets put up in front of the dugouts. The one two, swuck on and missed. Tigers load the bases, unable to cash in. We go to the top of the sixth. Here on the ACDN, five one Tigers.
All right, top half of the sixth here. Charlie Smith still in the circle. Madison Martin to lead it off. Madison has fly to the left and been hit by a pitch. First pitch on the outside corner for strike one. And the 1 0 pitch just outside. Board says 2 0, but I believe it's 1 2 now. It is one ball and two strikes. We're on a miss. Fifth strike out for Charlie. I'm going to bring up the first baseman, Caitlin Redman. Redman has flown out to the left and struck out. Little looper in the middle of the infield. Charlie will handle that herself. A little difficult to look up through that mask. Charlie able to battle through it. I'm going to bring up Elmsley Smith. First pitch from Charlie in there for strike one. <coughs> Second pitch catches the outside corner for strike two. So Charlie out ahead quickly. Two balls, no strikes. The 0 2. Struck her out. So Charlie strikes out two. Three up, three down. Inning. We go to the. Bottom half of the six, still 5 1 Tigers. All right, Angela Heimbeck will lead it off with the Tigers. Angela two for two. What an RBI single back in the fourth. She'll lead it off against Elmsley Smith. First pitch to Angela's high. Looks like a changeup. Looks like Martin's still behind the plate. One zero stays low. Oh, okay. Two zero pitch stays low. Three one three zero oh stays inside, so Heimbach draws her second walk. Got to bring up first base and Hope Dalton. Hi, 
Hot Hope has uh, had a sack of fight bond. Reached on a fielder's choice and singled. First pitch in there from Smith for strike one. 22 viewers, appreciate all y'all. I'm back at first. Bill one right in there for strike two. Again, we don't have the chat anymore, but you can email me, markbrown at andrewcollege.edu. markbrown at andrewcollege.edu. Let me know you're watching. Brown ball in the hole. The hope of their second hit. Two for three. That'll send up the catcher, Devin Weaver. Devin is lined out to short, had an RBI single, and popped up to the third baseman. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ninth hit on the day. Nine hits on the day. First pitch to Devin's inside. The 1 0 stays outside. <laughs> I'm back at second. Hope at first. Angela walked. Hope single. Two old pitch to Devin. On the way. <laughs> Stayed inside. Three balls and no strikes. Taken all the way, and Devin draws a walk. Out a little to bases for Charlie Smith. It looks like, uh, I believe that's Aaron Reagan. It is. Aaron Reagan, a pinch run for Devin. I'm sure Devin will re-enter the top half of the seventh. Charlie is 0 for 3. He's grounded out three times. First pitch in there for strike one. Yeah. Uh, one. Ground ball to short. Takes a wicked hop. One run will score. Two runs will score. A two RBI single there from Charlie. Okay, so with that two RBI single from Charlie, now makes it seven to one. We got a new pitcher. That is number twenty-eight, Chandler. Hmm, Culpepper maybe, Chandler Culpepper. All right, so Macy Ibster will step to the plate. Macy has been hit by a pitch and reached on a couple errors by the shortstop. Nobody out. Looks like Chandler Culpepper in the in the circle now. Gets it down, a nice bunt. Redmond to Faircloth. So a good sacrifice bunt by 
Macy, and that'll bring up Ashton Bray. Bray has popped out, reached, uh, was hit by a pitch and struck out. Tigers can get to uh, nine here before the end of the inning. The game will be over. Again, we're going to switch over and do baseball as soon as this one's over. First pitch stays inside from Cole Pepper. Hey, y'all y'all have got to talk. <laughs> Hard hit right down the third base line. Nice play over there by Bridges. Throws home. And Aaron is out. So a fielder's choice for Ashton. Okay. What about theirs? Okay. So no run scores. Just stay, just hold on to him and stay with me. Had to bring up Kenley Kennedy. Brown ball fouled on the third base line. Aaron Dow is at third. Let's see Kayla put her in. Might have put her in for Charlie so Charlie could get her ready. Ashton Bray at first. Little pop up right in the back here. Martin hauls it in. So we go to the top half of the seven, seven one Tigers here on the Andrew College Digital Network, and we'll be back. High top of the seven, seven one. First batter is Katie Thomas. One ball, one strike. Charlie Smith still in the circle. One one just outside. on the bracket. Two balls, two strikes. Sorry, we're trying to get organized here. we got to give a move real quickly. Just stays inside to Thomas. Baseball's probably going to be starting here for too much longer. We may not catch the very, very beginning of it, but we got plenty of people here and do our best. Lift it in the left. Ashton hauls it in for the first out. And that should bring up Allison Smith. Smith has singled. 
back in the fifth. One out. First pitch swung on and missed. Fouled off. O2 pitch. Ground ball. Sheffy ranging to her left. Strong throw. Beautiful stretch by Hope, but Smith with her second hit. Great stretch by Hope. Thought we had her. I think that caught her by surprise there. Got a little pull there. So that'll bring up Kaylee Faircloth. Faircloth has walked, had an RBI single and a sack bunt, so she's a perfect one for one. Loose leaped in the left. Oh, and it goes off a of brace glove. Kenley backing her up. Throw comes into third. So Smith able to go around to third. Faircloth with a double. Her second hit. And the grain not going down quietly. Had to bring up Sutton Bridges with one out. Bridges has singled and grounded out and popped out. Swing and a miss. Nice hustle there by Kenley Kennedy out there in center. Ball was more kind of left center, and it kind of just went off the top of Ashton's glove, and Kenley able there to back it up, make a strong throw to third, not in time, but the old one stays high. One one, just missed outside. Again, baseball still not started over there. We'll probably we'll see the umpires coming down the third base line. We're probably going to miss at least the first inning getting moved over there. But we'll catch you back up. Looper in the right comes Macy, unable to haul it in. Macy had it in her glove, couldn't hold on to it though. She was sliding and diving at it, so that'll be an RBI single for Bridges, and it's 7-2. It's still one out. Brittany Todd at the plate. Brittany has struck out twice and singled. Hamby, I got something you can be doing. Don't worry about that blue cord. The 1 0 pitch. Right in there for strike one. One is just outside. And we get ready to move. Two one stays low and inside. Three balls, one strike. One out. Catch the outside corner for strike two. Hammered right back at Charlie. She knocks it down. She'll make a play to first, which is the right thing to do. So an RBI ground out for Todd. 
They pick up another run, but there is two outs. And that'll bring up the pitcher, Jessica Perkins, the original pitcher. She's re-entering. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. First pitch just outside. Oh, it was in the house. All strike one, oh one. That's low. Nice pick up there by Devin. One ball, one strike. Two outs. Just missed outside. Two one. Lifted into Mace. Mace got a beat on it. The Tigers win 7-3. We're gone. We're headed to the baseball game here on the ACDN. You can pick us up at Andrew Fighting Tigers. <laughs> 